What's up everybody, how's it going? Welcome back. So, um, in the light of it being October, I think PlayStation Plus did us an honor of giving us a nice little, like, Halloween scary type of game. I don't, actually don't know if this is really scary or not, but it is a Donut game. So you already know I was super stoked to be trying this one. Uh, Vampire, never... Well, I, I did hear of it, but I'm not too sure, of course, it's about vampires, but um, I'm excited to see what the story is about behind it. So yeah, let's go ahead and get started, guys. Twelve dreams for the Red Queen under Crown of Stone. Eight voracious beasts born from eight restless nights. Four nails piercing the flesh of the sinner. Kind of has One like a prayer for the summoned Sweeney Todd type of vibe. It is perhaps the countdown to oblivion for the once proud city of London. It is perchance her London. inhabitants' last dance alone to face death and pestilence. Confronted by the eerie and unknown, mortals became desperate for answers. A flock's flight makes for an omen, the falling of a star, a dire presage. Turning to priests for interpretation when there was no reason to be found. When religion failed, men turned to science. I saw them build such vain cities, crafting machines made for endless war. New questions flourished as old answers withered. What is darkness but lurking sun? What is wall but enslaved stone? What is glass <laughs> but tortured sand? What is song but a call to Ooh. arms? What is hate but jilted love? What is life but death? Pending. So I was literally waiting on that other screen for the longest time, not knowing that I had to choose a slave slave slot, and I thought it was just like yeah. that was a different loading screen. So, since the apple, what can you do? <laughs> the sacred tree, mortality was believed to the be God's punishment, a righteous snare to keep mankind from ascending to the stars. They were all so. Death is not a wicked thing, nor some holy retribution. A true punishment would be to never know its sweet kiss. Awaken from the harshness and be born once more. I used to be obsessed with vampires when I was like in high school. I think a lot of people thought it was like a weird obsession. I mean, I can I can see like how it'd be such a weird obsession, but I just thought vampires were so cool. This one kind of seems like it'd be like the vampires like off of um, Queen of the Damned or something. Either that or Blade. So this is our character. Sweet. I used these like little ashes. Whoa. Okay. Um, I'm guessing we're following the trail of blood, since it's the only thing that's super like pigmented in this whole scene. Shit, we're gonna eat her. <laughs> oh, that is so cool. Sorry. <gasps> oh no. Is that like his wife or his girlfriend or someone? It's gonna turn her. Yeah. 
It didn't seem like he took that much blood, though. He said he was thirsty. Kind of seemed like he only, like... Oh, that's her brother. It only seemed like he, like, took a little blood from her. No. You know what you were doing. Hold on. Please, hold on. Explain. Nope. Ooh. Time to run. Let's go. These patrols are after me. No. No. Don't shoot. Okay. This is a nightmare. It's kind of like a dodging thing or faster. I need to get out of here. Is there a way to jump or no? I can't see. This can't be happening. Okay. No. All right. Please, well, I'm just stop. gonna keep I mean, running. You know, hum. Holy hell! What's going on? Oh, Mary. What have I done? What's all this about? Shit, where it go? Shetty. No. Oh. I can defend myself. Tricky bastards. Okay. Kill that thing! Over there! Who are you? R3 you lock on enemies. Sorry. But you left me no choice. Stuff. Okay, let's keep going. Who are you? Stupid beast! Okay. Oh, okay. That's to dodge. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Steady, boys. No, please, stop. <laughs> whoa, what was that? Who are you? Switch target. What do you want? Okay, seemed easy enough, I guess. I mean you no harm. I I need help. Die, you fucking leech! Ooh. <laughs> nah. Please, listen to me. I can't make any sense of this. Shut up, beast! Who are you? What is this all about? Eat him. Ah, ah, what in oh, God's son, I'll do the rest son. Of the job. Ah, ah, Just, just leave me. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, that was cool. <laughs> we almost just died, but that was cool. Run. The sun. Um, Feels like it's burning me to the bone. elements like fire will deal aggravated damage that will reduce your maximum health. Health gauge. Okay. This might be a little. Um, I need to find I somewhere to hide. Won't, I won't even like pay attention to like the sun or anything. Let me go. Ah. So yeah, I probably won't pay attention to the sun to and then like shelter. end up running out in the sun like some random time in the game. Is anybody there? What is this place? Hmm. The place seems abandoned. I should be safe enough here. Okay. Oh. Are we supposed to... Can we explore a lot in this game? Just 
figure since it's a don't nod game, maybe we'll get to explore some. But we'll see. Brother. I've just been running past everything. What have you done? Mary! Mary! I think they Mary. said like the game was I'm sorry. I don't know, 18, 17 or something? Whoever but did this I don't to know. us. The outfits don't look like they're that it. old. Yeah. Whoa. That one looks like a mummy. Is that another vampire? Jeez. Oh, clock. Wait. This one's dressed up fancy. Let's run through his pockets. Picking the dead's pockets? Are you serious? <laughs> I still have rent to pay. He's got no more responsibilities. What's this? Oh, watch. that was ours. Beautiful it is. We fancy to share the takings. <laughs> I suppose we are undertakers. <laughs> now, give him an eve. So then what happened to those guys? That's impossible. Hmm. One well, watch. Let's just do a quick look around the house real quick before... I think I'm supposed to go upstairs. Oh, maybe I can go in there too. Uh, fire, sun. Leeches do not fear the sun or fire, but they do not burst into flames or ashes when they are caught under rays of day daylight. But it hurts them good, really good. I have personally chained a vampire to a tree to see what would happen when the sun rises. Its skin blackened in a few minutes as if it was burning from the inside. Its eyes and flesh melted and I saw unholy bones move in the sequel. And bones move in the squeal of the beast. Try to escape all day long. In the sun. Wait. Uh, In the end, only a... Not sure what that word is. A uh, corpse remained, which started to slowly de degenerate when the sun disappeared behind the horizon. I cut its head off and finally destroyed it. And when I tried the same test with fire, the bloody leech never came back from the ashes. Fire is our weapon of choice, brethren. To burn the beast is the best way to kill it for good. From known your enemies. Okay. Shillings. I had better remain here until nightfall. Oh, oh, that's the entrance. Okay, so we'll go upstairs then. I don't think there's anything else for us to check downstairs. So I think this is our focal point of where we need to go. Vampires couldn't look at themselves in the mirrors. Like they had no reflection or something? Who goes there? His eyes are wicked though. Are you referring to me? So much to accomplish. So we're gonna find the person who killed us. I still have so much left that needs doing. Some man, some random man who just bit us in the alley. <laughs> Whoa! Hello, sir. Is that the one who dumped our body over? OD.
Johnny, this one's lost. We need to leave. And now! No. There's time. I can save him. That's the enemy coming! The orders are to evacuate the hospital! <sighs> Done. He'll live. And now what? We fight. Killing is a hell of a lot easier than healing. Hmm. No, it never got easy. Use the revolver. Okay. Bloody Diary. 15 of October. Bad sleep. Becky coughed all night. The fever made her delirious. I heard a loud noise in the morning. It's a big machine. Some man brought by the banks to dig a big hole in the ground. It was some sort of mechanical shovel. Maybe I could go there. Maybe I could go there and ask for some work. Becky needs medicine. 16th of October. I talked to the man with the mechanical shovel. They told me they are digging mass graves all over around London. Safety measures, apparently. Is there a new epidemic? The flu coming back? They had no work for me. Becky slept all a little last night. And the, fond the foundry has been closed. And there are no more jobs nearby. I, October 19th. I went to London to find some groceries and drugs. No trains. It took me a whole day to cross the... The... the with the Thames and come back. Becky seemed better. I made a a soup I found no drugs, only syringes and some sleeping pills on the black market. We have no money left. Maybe I could go to the Pembroke Hospital tomorrow, but it's far and I fear leaving my wife for so long. So Becky is the lady that's downstairs on the floor that looks like a zombie. October 19th. Becky threw up the meal a few hours after she ate. She is so frail now it makes me cry. She st she says her voices, she hears voices outside at night. She says she wants to eat meat. Where would I find meat? Tomorrow I'll barricade the house to protect us from looters. October 21st. The man with the mechanical shovel have stopped digging the mass grave. I heard shouts last night as if they were attacked. Now there are only a few boats Few boats throwing bodies day and night into giant hole. The smell is terrible. We should have left this house a week ago, but Becky, she refuses to leave. She'd rather die, she said with a nasty smile. Why is she torturing me so? October 22nd. Becky just attacked me. She jumped on me from the stairs and tried to bite me. I had to smack her, but she smacked me back. I went upstairs and locked myself in the bad bedroom. Now I can hear her cry and mumbling downstairs. I retrieved the gun I hid in the ceiling since the war to protect the house. Now I'm ready to use to protect myself from my own wife. 23rd. I cannot sleep at all. Becky spent the whole night scratching at the door asking for my help, begging me to let her in so I was afraid to open it. I'm just waiting for her to die now. It would not be long. I pray God it will end soon. 24th. I was so hungry I tried to go downstairs this morning. Becky was sitting in the armchair by the chimney. She was panting like a dog, looking at me without moving, just following me around the room with her eyes. I pointed the gun at her sore face, and she did not react. I could not pull the trigger. I went back to my room. 25th. The house is silent like a tomb. No more noises. Becky is dead now. Forgive me, my love. I was unable to save you. Whoa. I'll be with you soon enough. Whew. So we know what happened to them now. So he's died now. He probably died from starvation. Starvation and thirst, maybe? This makes no sense. None of it. No sense at all. It's a nightmare. That's it. So be it. Mm, ain't gonna work. Rational thinking only. Not 
not gonna work. I think we can only die by fire, I think it said. Oops. Vampire. I like the music though. It's nice. Soothing. Told you. Just bled out and even more thirsty now. <laughs> this is absolute madness. I've lost touch with the real. <laughs> I must find him to understand me. what I have become. Okay. All right. Let's go find this guy that bit us then. How's it turn faster? You hold down X. We don't have any bullets. Where is it? It's closed. These people want me dead. I need to leave now. Mm -hmm. Do we have oh shit? Here's the leech. Here. I was gonna say, do we have like super strength or anything? Whoa! That was cool. That was really cool. Spinning. <laughs> it's locked, all right. It's locked, all right. <laughs> Let's go. Kind of just like looking for stuff around. You never know. You never know what we may find around here. Okay, I don't think there's anything. Let's go. It's locked. Oh shit! Maybe not. It's locked. Hiya. Oh, hello. Used stake. Okay. Shelter key. Hand, offhand, weapons can be used for pressing triangle. They have attacks with special effects consuming stamina. I'm still in Southwark. Over there! I must reach the There's West End. Stun. Uh, press triangle to your to your stake and inflict stun damage. Die, vermin! Go back <laughs> press X to bite the stun enemy. Biting an enemy provides us blood to use skills that also refills your health gauge. <laughs> cool. <laughs> A strength. A strength I never knew I had. <laughs> I cannot enter. Now that you have blood, press R1 to release the vampire skill. <laughs> what was that? I just freaking used all my blood. Instead, all right. Kind of slow. Like the dodging is not that precise either. It's a fire. Rawr. I feel like a 
child learning the limits of my body. <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. I'm just like biting people. Oh, come on. This guy is so slow. My strength. My reflexes. I'm not human anymore. Common handle part shillings. You think? You're going around biting people. I don't think you're human, dude. I mean, damage everything, destruction, destruction is my middle name. What's the main character's name anyway? I don't even know. Um, South Park Bridge. I want to go to London. This is in London? I think it's in London. I want to go to London. Liverpool, to be precise. Just to watch some good old football. Reach North Bank, okay. Uh, join the ranks. Your king and British, your king and country need you. Join the British ranks and help the brave lads in, at the front. Yeah. London opinion. So it's London. My poor sister. If only I had controlled my need for blood. Mary, someone will pay for what happened to you. For what happened to us. Oh! I have this first. Is that a rat? Blood. <laughs> this is dis. Despicable. It's locked. <laughs> I cannot enter. I just like saw like the little X symbol pop up, so I pressed it and I didn't even like realize. Um, the dizziness from the jump. What I was, what I was I picking up and it turned out to be a freaking rat. It's locked, all right. It's locked. What's over here? Shillings. Oh, it's I think locked. I already went that way. It's locked, all right. Okay. The music is super satisfying. <laughs> nom nom nom. I have this thirst for blood. Yes. What will <laughs> London have to say to me? Taking some homeless people's money. I cannot enter. Their money. There's so many questions unanswered. Mm -hmm. More shillings. Lime house stock. I think it's a Another house. corpse. Have the very streets of London become a mausoleum? Man has been drained of all blood, but I can still smell the scent of it. Oh, someone's still alive. Oh, I follow the scent's trail. Perhaps it will lead me to my assailant. Okay, toggle your vampire senses. Fresh blood, the smell is so strong. I love that. That's so cool. But wait, I want to look up here. Cool, okay. Um, I could also go back there, but I wanna just look around real quick. Grease. This is a slaughterhouse. 
This is a slaughterhouse. It's locked. I love, I like the way he talks. Shillings. Is there nothing around here that I could use to open this? It's locked, all right. No? All right. Well, I guess it's fine. Maybe we'll be able to unlock it later. So cool. Hello. What's up here? Hmm. It's locked, all oh, right. Nothing. Okay. It's locked. I know, I know. Follow the task at hand. Where has everyone gone? Maybe that they were warned about you, dude? According to the blood patterns, that's where the victim was attacked. So that must be the killer's trail. You just found a new hideout there you can spend your XP while resting off crafts. Okay. New hideout unlocked. Hello. Handle part. Cool. Crafting bench. Let's wait a little while before... Before we decide to... Like, let's get to know our weapons before we do anything crazy. For looking away when the when they mock my color, I hate myself for crying like a girl when they insult me. I hate myself for swearing like a boy when they're gone. I hate myself for hating my parents. I hate myself for smiling when customers call me Sabrina. I hate myself for never finding the courage to tell Tom how I truly feel. I hate myself. Uh, you just discovered a hint to reveal a secret about them that's hit a citizen or someone related to them. Oh, is this Sabrina? At Tom? Last, a little life. Hi. Alice, I saw your paper. You Are you alright? The killer Is there any way I can help you? This bar. I don't know. Maybe some Maybe of the you locals could just saw talk him. to me. Maybe you prefer to speak with Tom then. He's more agreeable talking to strangers. Hmm. What's going on? What's going on around here? Where is everyone? Too many dead, sir. First the epidemic. Now all these terrible murders. Mm. What have you heard about the epidemic? There's a Spanish flu. Yeah. Killed so many last summer. Thought we'd seen the last of it. Dozens dying every week. Are the authorities doing anything? Nothing. There are so many quarantine zones in London now. It's gotten really hard to travel across town. The murders. What can you say about them? Bodies found in the streets every morning. Drained of blood. It's just horrible. Some say the sewer dog is back. The sewer dog? What's that? No one knows. People have always disappeared around these parts. The ancients say it's the sewer dog coming out to feed. But now he's killing in the streets. Okay. I'll leave then. Thank you. Are you Tom? Uh, unknown. Good evening, sir. I wondered if I could ask for your help. Wow. Are you drunk? You look like you need a drink. Yeah, yes. Drunk. I apologize for my outfit. It's been... It's been a long night. Been there, seen that. Don't worry, things can only get worse. Mm hmm. Has anybody entered the bar recently? Can't say. Sorry. I spent the night making love to that gorgeous bottle, see? This is important, sir. 
Are you sure no one has come in here in the last few hours? I don't know and I don't care. This is a free country. People still have the right to come and go, don't they? What does she like about this guy? What's going on around here? It's like everybody is hiding. You must be new here. Have you not heard about the murders? Everybody fears the return of the sewer dog. Who is this sewer dog? It's a local bogeyman. Convenient answer bogeyman. for every crime that happened for decades. You murdered someone. Blame the sewer dog, eh? You make it sound like it's a fairy tale. People will always believe in monsters. It's easier than accepting their own darkness. We can all be monsters. Truth. I'll leave you to your bottle then. The truth. Hello, good sir. Or are oh, you God, Tom? Sir, you look like Jonah's whale. Just spat you out of hell. Can I get you a drink? No, thank you. He looks like um. I'm not. Not Owen. thirsty. The well, last grab a chair too. and get some rest. This is going to be another long night. Oh, this is Tom then. I'm looking for someone who might have passed through here recently. Wondered if you might help. It's been quiet tonight. The only other person I've seen went straight up to his room. <laughs> Thought it was kind of rude, actually. You mean he's still here? Well, yeah. He paid for the entire week. <laughs> I need to meet this man. I have questions. Just climb the stairs and knock on the first door. I heard him open his window, so I guess he's still awake. And, sir, uh, yes? no funny business, you hear me? This is a respectable establishment. No promises, but thank you. It's locked, all right. <laughs> Climb the stairs. I hope I live long enough to see them where- This is no place for you. Prewen has several patrols roaming the area. They do not pursue me. But they're looking Ooh. for vampires, and they're most efficient. They'll not relent until the killer has been identified. I have a common objective, but I require- Shh. I think someone is eavesdropping. Are you certain? Hmm. Yeah, they're vampires too. In you might there. as well come in, whoever you are. Slowly, vampire. Oh, Who are maybe you? they're not vampires. I, I mean you no harm. Say it's a vampire. Present yourself. Or maybe the lady he was talking I, to was a vampire. I need they had the little a word. Down. With anyone. That's a little extreme. <laughs> oh. Oh. Well, that's something I can do for you. <sighs> and who might you be? I don't know. I won't tell you first. I'm not sure that I know anymore. Might I at least learn the reason of your presence? That's none of your concern. Sir, you have entered my room in the middle of the night, pale as a corpse and shaking like a tree. <laughs> so please, indulge me. Something, someone, is molesting people. In fact, killing them. Biting them. The calling card of a vampire, like you. I've been hunted down in the streets and attacked. I'm a victim here too. I... I believe you. Then if you are not a vampire, who or what are you? <laughs> Dr. Edgar Swansea of the Brotherhood of St. Paul. I am performing an independent investigation here in an attempt to understand precisely what is going on. What do you know? Who are you talking to? What is this brotherhood? All valid, but if I keep choosing every single option, I'm never gonna finish the game. 
uh, by the time that October ends. So we're gonna go ahead and say, help me then. Then help me find the culprit. I may. If you'll first tell me why you opened this door. I followed a trail. The scent of blood from a recent victim. It led me here. You thought I was your aggressor. That explains a great deal. We are both chasing the same shadow. Perhaps. This is all new to me. I'm not even certain what I'm looking for. You should let me handle this affair. You've no idea what you're up against. No. I will find the monster. He is mine. How will you do any better than I? But then let me ask you this. What are your intentions if you find the killer? Um... Demand answers? I will at last have the answers to my questions. Hmm. Then I can only wish you good hunting. And pray we shall meet again. For sure. See you later, guy. Oh, what you got in your drawers? Huh? It's locked. <laughs> uh, interrogate the locals. If Swansea is not my attacker, it means somebody else came here tonight. Not long ago, this Someone must know something. Evening, sir. Can I help you? I have a few questions for you. <sighs> well, if you must. I spoke to Dr. Swansea. He's not the man I'm looking for. Now, I want the truth. The truth? What do you mean? I suspect that someone else was here tonight. And I don't think Tom wants to tell me about it. I'm Tom. just the barmaid here, okay? If Tom says you're the only visitor we had, then you're the only visitor we had. I can feel your fear, madam. Please, tell me what's going on. <sighs> it's Will. William Bishop. He came in here earlier tonight and he... Well, I thought he was going to clock someone. <laughs> Tell me about this William Bishop. Will was a sailor who worked at the canning factory before he lost that job. A nice bloke, really. He's never been violent. Until tonight. Why keep it a secret? Why not tell me about it? Tom's nothing if not loyal. After Will lost his job, he offered him one ear. They used to be good mates. But recently, Will... Will started to get very aggressive. I see. Maybe he's a vampire. <laughs> Thank you for your candor. I'll be sure to talk to Tom. There's gotta be something can be done again. Bye. This bullshit mess. No. Welcome back. Did you find what you were after? I can't say I have. Are you sure no one else came into your bar before I arrived? Hey, I told you, you were the only other stranger I've had. <laughs> Um, as a vampire, you can force a civilian to reveal information thanks to hint you discovered blue pop. Tom, talk to me about the visit from your old friend, William. Yes, Will came by tonight, but he's not oh, my nice. friend anymore. I need to find him. It's a matter of urgency. Do you know where he is? You could try his boat. It's up by the North Pier. He sleeps there when he's too drunk to get home. Please describe him to me. What'd you expect? He's a tall, sick bastard with a bad rash and torn old clothes. <laughs> William used to be strong. Now he's a mess. Thank you, Tom. If you see him, tell him I don't want him back here unless he cleans up his act, okay? Okay. Real quick, I want to see what you have behind here. Nothing. Shoot. Damn it. I told you all there was to know. Okay, I'm leaving. Jeez. Um, now we gotta go find that guy. I will get to the bottom. Um, more. Okay. Bottom of this intrigue. What's been done to me? To this city? Inspect the boats. The body is still warm. 
This man has just been drained of blood. Blood and empty gin bottles. This bishop fellow is something of a heavy drinker. What's this? Some sort of note. Um, multiple deaths in a docks region. We believe a nasty leech is involved. Locate the beast. Purge and quickly. Warning. According to recent reports, the vampire is very violent. Approach with extreme caution. I know we lack men at this part of town, but don't send rookies to investigate the case. If I'm correct, we've gotten frenzied one killing each night. As we've, as always, searched abandoned places first, old houses, basements, sewers, or warehouses, destroyed Leech Brothers. These men, they're a company of professional vampire hunters. This corpse has been dried of its blood, just like the previous victim. This man was armed. He tried to defend himself. There are blood splats on the other side of the canal. I must reach that barge. Can I teleport over there? No? Yeah, okay. Cool. Track the killer. Follow the blood trail from the pier. Opportunity to attack out of combat silently behind an enemy. It's locked, all right. Oh, there are enemies in here. I didn't even notice. What the heck? I'd step back, sir. Over there. There's one in I wish I could throw things. Yeah, I wish we could like throw like knives or something. That'd be pretty cool. Can I? I want to go down. Wait, how is that to bite? I think it's X, but it's not. Wasn't letting me grab him. Enemy card. Press to spot enemies around and display enemy cards. Some enemies are more resistant to certain types of damage. There are four types of resistance. Melee, blood shadow, orange indicates medium resistance, red indicates high resistance. It's an eight. Oh. Watch it. It's a killer. How do you grab him? Ranged weapons. Equip and press triangle to use your ranged weapons and inflict both standard damage and stun damage. Beware that your ammo is limited.
I don't remember how to grab them so I can bite them. Follow the blood trail. Over there! But X wasn't like it wasn't letting me do it. Um, it wasn't letting me do it during battle, like grab someone. Come here, num num. Nah. Okay. More fresh blood. The whole building reeks of it. The scent is so Whoa. strong it makes me dizzy. Scythe. Equip a two-handed weapon and press triangle to use the special ability. The scythe, for instance, can be used to parry an oncoming attack. Incoming, inflicting heavy stun damage if timed correctly. <gasps> I can't. How do you, um, must have please stop? You're my last and dearest friend. I can't stand it anymore. This place reeks of bloodshed. Friend. This creature is bedeviled. I must put it down. William. Like William the Bloody from Buffy the Vampire Slayer. I cannot see. I don't know how to like take up the gun or anything, so this is what we get in. Oh shit. <laughs> Should have ate more rats before coming in. Damn. <laughs> well, I don't know. I, I don't know how to use the gun or anything. Like I was like, try pressing like the up button and then the triangle and then, I don't know. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. It took us all the way back here. Nope, I'm not, dip I'm not gonna dip go after them guys again. I'm just gonna go this way. Just go forward with it. How do I freaking change these weapons though? As one we shall overcome this. We've done it before. Who's he talking to? This creature is bedeviled. I must put it down. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know like how to switch out the weapons. This pops up and I have to look up.
That's something I need to look out for as well. My stamina levels. Oh. No. No touchy. Use bludgeon. William was an honorable man. I could have saved him. Mr. Hampton, are you in there? We knew him well, another lost soul, a kindred spirit. Sir, listen to the sound of my voice. I am... I am a doctor. You're suffering from shock. Oh I shit, he's still alive. My flock, they stray without me. Oh! Hello. Remember, certain scowls are every bit as resistant as we are. Who are you? What do you mean by Scowl? You truly are a newborn. I should have realized... Wait. You, <laughs> you are the woman from the bar. Oh, okay. Are you... like me? Yeah. Can you help me? I believe, sir, I already have. She's the one that whooshed out of the room. Whooshed. By George and the Saints, you've solved the mystery of these terrible murders. Patience, good fellows, I've come to offer help. Just give me a moment to secure my boat. We can leave this awful place. William was not the evil man they claimed. He was just taken by the thirst. He needed his drink. This man requires medical attention. We'll see he gets to the nearest hospital. No, please, I almost tend to my fault. My flock needs me. Yes. Go with the good Dr. Swansea. He's resourceful, and I'm sure he'll take good care of you. You'd best come as well. The sun is soon to rise, and you'll need a place to rest. Cool, thank you. I just need a moment. If I can learn something about what has happened to William, I'll be a step closer to understanding what happened to me. Alrighty, then. All right, guys, I guess we're going to end the episode right here. So far, you know, the game's kind of slow. A little too slow for my liking. There was some cutscenes where I kind of felt like I was gonna fall asleep or something. I was kind of like dozing off a bit. Um, but you know, hopefully the game will pick up in the next episode. But yeah, if you liked today's episode, like, comment, subscribe, tell me what you think. Hopefully the game will get better, but we'll see. Uh, it takes time, you know, time and patience for like some games. But um, yeah, we'll see. Uh, hope you guys liked it, and I will catch you focus later. Peace.